Hi Pisces, I hope you're all doing well in today's reading with we'll looking at whoever you're thinking about for January. Someone having a hard time moving on from you, wanting to come back around is bottom deck energy. I see reconciliation here in the outcome. There is delays here, but it's coming through. They're wanting you to have patience if you're wanting to collaborate, work with this person. 6-6 six, six, talks about partnership, harmony, balance. This person's thoughts when it comes to you, the sun in reverse. Well, right now they're unhappy when it comes to the situation. If they're married, they're, con they're concerned about their children. Um, they're... Their children are very much on their mind. Some of them could be going through a divorce and something about child custody. Why is son here in the reverse permit? And others of you, no children. What is this person's rest of moon? I'm seeing something about a mother and father here. So if they're not married, it can have something to do with their childhood, but Overall, it's a feeling of just being unhappy. Um, so this may be someone who's taking a break. They've withdrawn not only from you, but those around them. They're in hermit mode, isolated. They're thinking a lot. It's almost like someone who's trying to recharge their batteries here. Their feelings for you, two of wands, four of swords. Well, they're at a crossroads. They have a decision to make and they're not wanting to make that decision. And as a result, things are stuck here. They're stuck, four of swords on a break. Why is two of wands here for how this person will be feeling about Pisces? Yeah, they're mourning something, something from their past. And others of you, this is you. You let go, Hang, hanging man in reverse, five of cups. So what they're missing, two of cups, and hangman is Pisces. So they're missing you. They're missing the friendship here. There was a fallout. Look, three of cups in reverse. He's mourning the three cups fallen over. Yeah. There's no communication, no forward movement, eight of wands in reverse, but we have that two of cups, the soulmate bond. But perhaps there was deception here. Someone here had the mentality that grass was greener on the other side and they're, re they're having regrets now. That is coming through. How this person thinks you feel about them, eight of swords in reverse, hangman upright. That you're over them. You're not putting in the effort. You think they're a waste of time. You're not doing anything. You're focused on yourself, hangman. How does, how will Pisces be feeling about this person for the rest of May 2022? How will Pisces be feeling? Let's see if they're correct, King of Pentacles. How will Pisces be feeling about the person on their mind? Power. Well, you're focused on building a solid foundation here for yourself, your coins, your money, building for your future. Some of you feel like your finances aren't in order. There may have been a job loss, but there was instability here um, within a family situation, a work situation, or just finances in general. But you're coming out on top. You're coming through as a king, right? So I think if there was any financial troubles that was in the past, you're coming out of that. This is where you're headed. This is financial security, harmony within the home, peace, King of Pentacles. Clarify the King of Pentacles for how Pisces will be feeling. Empress in reverse, moon. Yeah, it's like you're done with emotions. You're putting your emotions aside and you're doing what needs to be done here. Just the day to day is what I'm getting. Yeah, Seven of Swords. You're avoiding this businessman, businesswoman. You have money on your mind. <laughs> I like that for you. So yeah, they are correct to, on some level that you are very focused on yourself, right? 
some of you could have had a family or been committed to this person and you're taking a step back because of this person's deceptive ways. We did have Seven of Swords twice. That will be for some of you. This person's intentions, we have Five of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, this can be a situation where someone ghosted you. They're abandoning the situation. They're dropping this. In their feelings, they were saying, I'm at a crossroads. I need more time. They felt like you weren't really as invested and they're choosing on choosing to drop this what they want from you knight of cups in reverse well i don't think they want anything from from you pisces they they need to figure out what they want here out of life uh, it's a very empty energy here some of them could be also going through health issues um sun does talk about overall well-being and hermit ruling our sixth house of health co-workers so that is what they're concerned about. Something about their health, definitely. Eight of Cups judgment. Yeah, they don't want anything right now. They don't. They feel like they don't have anything to offer this situation. And as a result, what action they're taking? Six of Pentacles in reverse. No action. And some of you, it can be because they were breadcrumbing. They were giving to two, but if that is not the case, it's just saying, I don't have anything to give to the situation right now. Some of them have to wrap up something else here, right, before they can offer anyone anything. Your outcome, six of wands, six of cups, ace of pentacles, universe. Now this depends on you, Pisces. If you want reconciliation, I see that. But there is delays here. I asked for a timing. They're saying Seven of Pentacles, Justice, and Averse. I mean, it can be anywhere from July to October if we take it literally. But usually Seven of Pentacles is just a card of patience. So this situation can work out. Six, six, right? Harmony, balance, which I mentioned. And you both can come together and work on this. There is a beautiful bond here. Um, there's a strong emotional connection, and this can be successful. Six of Wands does talk about victory, right? Also, side message, if you've been applying for jobs and you feel like giving up, they're saying don't. You will have that opportunity, something beautiful coming towards you that will also offer you a lot of financial security. You'll be very successful. So it really depends on what you're focused on. I mentioned work because you were in the King of Pentacles energy, right? So finances, your career weighing heavy on you, weighing heavy on your mind. Those of you that want new love, <laughs> again, right? Look at that, King of Cups. Because I asked about new love. We have Death, Four of Wands in Reverse, King of Cups, Nine of Cups, Lovers, Judgment. Yeah, so again, the same message if you're wanting a second chance judgment and this has a lot of potential to be very successful uh, union some of you have to wait for this person to go through a separation a divorce or you may have to energies can sometimes be vice versa and others of you yeah you're putting an end you're going through some vital changes here that are necessary and some of you what is leaving here is unstable connections um, energies that you can't depend on i really like this for you i mean it can be if it's not outside influences you know other people it can be just your emotions have been all over the place and there's emotional stability headed in once you're there with the nine of cups i see you attracting <laughs> look at this the lover's judgment this can be twin flames past life soulmate whatever but a very very strong emotional physical bond here we have cancer pisces scorpio we have gemini here that you can be attracting this energy will be wish fulfillment and some of you it's the same person that has been non-committal unstable and they're stepping up their game so it really depends let's get you some oracle cards but came through twice <laughs> 
some of you may have met this person online that is how it came through daredevil sweet messages so in the outcome definitely they can be reaching out sending you a sweet message usually six of cups do you see he's offering her a bouquet of flowers so yes they're taking that chance Ooh, some of you may run into this person um, at a bar a club some party gathering right if we look at the imagery but be careful if this person's already committed. They did have a decision here, right? We have drama. Yeah. We also have still hurt. Yeah, do you see the happy face, the sad face? Some of you, this pr person's putting on a mask here, a front to the world that everything's well, but it's not. They're, they're very down about something going on in their life. Can be drama between the both of you or just external to you both. We have reminders. Yeah, there is happy day yeah. <laughs> happy days ahead in terms of this connection, six of wands. So it's just a phase here. If someone's been quiet or they've distanced it, your, themselves and there's not, not any, you know, major challenges here, I think it's just a matter of time. With reminders, they do think of you, they miss you. Right? Little things may remind them of you. So you haven't left their thoughts. That is if you even care. Some of you are not, you don't care. We have hiding from you. Yeah, that's Hermit, Four of Swords. But they still care about you. We have I still care and love wins. So they can't hide for too long. It's almost like someone who's repressing their feelings for you as well, for whatever reason. Running from their feelings. daredevil comes through amazing chemistry <laughs> do you see that they do have a lot of desire passion for you pisces okay i love the two of you for different reasons it's been really difficult making a choice two of wands they're at a crossroads. I don't know what to do, so I'm not doing anything. You're saying I'm not doing anything, so nothing's happening. It's like some of, some of them are married. We have I love my family. I'm trying not to get too attached to you. Or there's something about a mother or father that was wanting to come through that can have a strong influence on this person. But it's almost like they're trying to hide from you. They're trying to run from this connection, but in the outcome, they can't. They can't hide from themselves, right? They can't change the way they feel about you. It's, almost, it's like they chose the other person, whoever, it can be a family member, a significant other, but then in the outcome, they're wanting to come back to you. So then you'll have a choice to make here. And some of you are saying no, right? Ace of Pentacles, I'm turning down this offer. So it really depends. Look at that, look at that. Hiding from you, I do have feelings for you, but I'm trying to convince myself I don't. Someone who's running from their feelings. I don't have the ability to love you right now. I already have too much on my plate. Yeah, this has to do... It can be their day-to-day, -day, but something about children or family. Uh, sorry, children or health. That is taking up a lot of their energy here. What advice do you have for Pisces? Organization. 
Wow, yeah, that's exactly what you're doing, King of Pentacles. Increase your productivity by sorting out any chaos and confusion around you. Declutter your personal space to allow the flow of new revitalizing energy. Some of you literally may be organizing your space, your home, right? Is it spring? Yeah, spring cleaning, something along those lines. But getting your finances in order. And we have the unknown. A recent event may have surprised or confused you. Something will be revealed to you soon to help you understand the universe works in mysterious ways. I mean, I'm not sure what that's about, Pisces. It'll be different for each one of you. Um, if it's in regards to the situation, yeah, if you've been confused about something, it's not making sense. They're saying the answers will come to you. Meanwhile, you know, the day-to-day, -day, they're wanting you to focus on sixth house matters is what is coming through strongly here. Planning for the future, organizing, strategizing, investing in yourself, king of pentacles. Money's looking good though, or that is where you're headed at least. So thumbs up here. Yes, Pisces, that is what I have for you. Take care of yourself and I'll see you next week. Bye.